Hi, I'm Rob Heinemann. I'm a professor of statistics at Monash University in Australia. For more than 25 years, I've been helping businesses and organisations with their forecasting problems. For example, I helped the Australian government develop better forecasts for pharmaceutical sales in Australia. The government subsidises the sales of pharmaceutical products and so it's necessary to forecast the sales of different products in advance in order to be able to budget appropriately. After two years in which the government underestimated sales by more than a billion dollars, they asked me if I could come up with something better. As a result, I developed the ETS framework based on exponential smoothing forecasts. Now the budget is within 1% of the actual expenditure. Previously, it was in error by about 20%. Good forecasting can make a big difference. I've helped dozens of organisations and businesses in a similar way, although most forecasting errors don't cost a billion dollars. I've helped fertiliser manufacturers forecast sales so they can reduce warehouse costs. I've worked with call centres to forecast the number of calls received so they can schedule enough people to answer the phone. I've developed forecasting models of passenger numbers for airlines. I've been helping the New Zealand government to forecast the Maori population for the next 100 years. Recently, I've been working with several electricity organisations to forecast long-term electricity demand. Through this work I've developed some new statistical forecasting techniques, such as the ETS framework, and I've developed some new algorithms to help forecasters, such as the Auto.Arima algorithm. The computer programs that I've written for my consulting work are available for you to use via the forecast package in R. In this course I'd like to teach you how these tools work and how to use them most effectively. Recently I wrote a free online textbook about forecasting with my colleague George Athanasopoulos. We wanted to make information about the best forecasting methods widely accessible and we wanted to help people learn to use them. This course will be based on my new textbook and will use the forecast package in R. We will start with some simple forecasting methods such as the naive forecast based on the most recent observation and build the model complexity until we get to dynamic regression models. We will explore forecast evaluation methods, starting with simple tools such as mean absolute percentage errors, but later covering more sophisticated methods such as time series cross-validation. This course is to be run in partnership with Revolution R and will involve two one-hour sessions each week for six weeks. Between sessions, there will be some homework for you to practice your forecasting skills. Throughout the course, you will be able to network and interact with other class members through an online community. I'm assuming that you can already use R, although it should not be hard to get up to speed by undertaking a few online tutorials. I'm also assuming that you know a little statistics, such as how to fit a multiple regression model to some data. But you do not have to know any time series or forecasting to do the course. Hopefully you will know enough at the end of the course to be confident in handling many time series forecasting problems, and enough to avoid those billion dollar mistakes.